hello guys welcome to my channel uh, in today's video i want to show you how you can add your bank details in your google adsense now when you create your google adsense you will have to add your bank details your account details or your payment method so that once you reach the threshold of hundred dollar your money will be transferred or wired into your bank account so you can see here in my own google adsense here you can see action required there is something to check in your adsense for you to pay my account i have made my payment threshold if I didn't add my account here, I can't be able to get or receive my money. So to add my account, I'll come to this, go to payment or better still, I can come to this payment and click on it and go to payment info and click on it. So if you're in Nigeria, make sure you watch this video carefully. You can see here payment account is YouTube. To receive payout, please choose a valid payment method. I'll come here and click on this update. If it opens, I'll come here and click on this add payment method. I'll click on it. You can see here we have add a payment method and we have two payment methods here. We have add new wire transfer details or add new check details. Now this wire transfer details means that you have to add and put your bank details so that the money will be wired directly into your bank account. While the second option is maybe if you add it, they will send the money through your post office just like you receive your PIN. So if you're in Nigeria that we have a very poor postal system, I will advise that you use the first one as new wire transfer details. So click on it and go and add your bank details. Now if it opens, you can see here, to receive payout by wire transfer, contact your bank for exchange rate and fee. Bank account must be located in Nigeria and in US dollar currency. So if you want to add your bank account in Google AdSense, make sure you have your domiciliary account, that's your dollar account. If you don't have your dollar account, you can go in any of the Nigeria banks and open your dollar account. For my own account, dollar account, I'm using Zeni Bank and I open it for free. So you can check any of the banks, access, GT, and open your dollar account. So now to add your payment detail, first of all, you come here in the first one here. This one says beneficiary ID. This one I don't know, so it's optional. So now come on this one here and add your name on the bank account. That is the name, your bank name. You can also come here and see enter your full name as shown on your bank statement so i'll come here and add my name so if you type it make sure you go through it again and look confirm it now here is the bank name that's the name of the bank and come here and type it so here is the swift code in case you don't know your swift code you can come to google here maybe for instance you're using zenith bank and come here and type zenith bank swift code swift code and enter so you can see right here is zeni bank swift code you can copy it and paste it let me copy it from here so come here and paste my swift code so here my swift code right here is account number so come here and add your account number your dollar account number i'll add my own here so after that, I'll come in and retype your account number here. Make sure you don't do mistake. So when you are done retyping your account number, you can confirm your, your information and check if they are correct. Scroll down and you can see here, set as primary payment method. If you want to set this account as a primary payment method for this absence, you can leave it here on this tick and come in and click on save and wait while it processes. You can see that my payment method has been added and once i refresh this or maybe during some time this whole year will disappear you won't see it again now let me refresh it first okay you can see that you can't see it here anymore so once the time reaches i will receive my payment i can always come here and edit your payment method or as well you can add another payment method so that's how you can actually add your bank or payment method on google adsense so guys if you found this video helpful and after watching it please make sure you click subscribe to my channel like share and comment so that you will stay tuned in case i upload new videos thank you guys and see you guys in my next video bye